Hey, happy Sunday everybody. So it's 5-6 uh, day today, May 6th. 5 plus 6 is 11. 2018 is 11 as well, so it's a double 11 day today. Um, and it's all still about the 5. Um, I'll leave a link to my video that I uploaded yesterday. Because I know Saturdays isn't exactly the best day to be uploading and giving out information on all of this on a Saturday. Um, as I know people have, you know, other things that they're doing. Yes, so do we, don't we, Chucky? Um, but it's just these numbers that they're so thick and fast at the minute that I've had to put it, the video out yesterday. I had no other option because it was all about the five, yesterday being the double five. But then it turns out that the earthquake just before the the volcano in Hawaii, which was on the Friday, day after I'd actually uh, recorded the video all about it, um, was a 5.0 earthquake. 5.0 Hawaii. Um, I mean, most people will know about the television show Hawaii Five O. I didn't know it was still actually going. Um, but there's a modern day version of it, but I just remember the old version from, wow, the 1960s. I was born in 75, so it must have been repeats or still going at that time, I don't know. Hawaii Five O, clear Five O reference five. Number five is alive. That was the video from Saturday, which yeah, I will leave the link to. So please check it out if you didn't get a chance yesterday. It's all about Johnny Five is alive, but you'll notice that alive is. Evil A backwards as well. Alive, evil, A backwards. So alive is still the same letters as evil A. See that? A being the first letter, one, evil one. Check it out, it's today's date, 6th of May, 65. That's the 11, 89 in reverse reduced. 11th Fibonacci number. Show that for 89. Most people know that. Also the 24th prime. Huge number. 24 as in time. Hex of 137. 137th prime. It's 33. It's 33, 137th prime there. That's for 89. Number five is Evil A, alive. Just want to point out the 155 ordinal. Because I spoke about that as it's also what um, exit time is in reverse Fibonacci, which I showed in the video before that. So that's the reverse Fibonacci cipher there. Not reducing it, so the top number's there for the letters. Okay. Exit time came to 155, that's the top one in that reverse cipher. 155. Number 5 in reverse ordinal is also 155. Ordinal 115. 11 times 5, 55. Reverse reduced again, it's that day, today's date. Number five, reverse reduced, five, six, 56. May 6th. So 155, huge number at the moment. It's following me around. I just wanna remind people as well, this is the moon phases for this month, May. 155 is there. That's the new moon for this month, 5155. Five. That's where we are today. That's the Mother's Day Sunday in a week's time. That's the Jerusalem 70th anniversary. 
big three days here that I'm speaking about. But also that Saturday as well. So 155, new moon date, following me around. Now something else that happened yesterday, 5-5, five five, was a rocket launch. My video yesterday was about Saturn V, how that's launched 13 times in the past when it was to do with all the Apollo missions. Saturn V was the rocket system, launched 13 times. Yesterday, NASA launched a rocket called InSight on the 5th of May. Yeah, you'll find various videos on YouTube about all that. InSight. I want to point out the way that they're spelling it, in and then sight. It's got a capital I, capital S. And there we go, there's the video from yesterday. Saturn V launched 13 times. But yeah, InSight then, NASA launched yesterday. InSight in full reduced is 41. It's a reminder, it's the 13th prime, 41. 13, master of time, octal 33. 13, master of time. 13th prime, 41. The rocket launched yesterday, InSight, 41, full reduced. Reverse bacon, 155. Just a reminder of 155 again. 155. 155. Next new moon is 155. 5 times 31 is 155. Notice how that's backwards. 13, 5. Very important date. 13th of May, Mother's Day. Week's time in the US. So that's Mother's Day in the USA next week, Sunday 13th of May, 513. And that can be done 51 times 3 to get you 153 for Cisha Pisces fish. Now May 13th is 133rd day of the year. So May 14th, sorry the day before that, May 12th, so that's the Saturday. That's the 132nd day of the year, day before Mother's Day. So just to quickly follow on from that, May 13th, 133rd day of the year. Okay, Mother's Day. Marvel Comics in Ordinal is 133. 52 reduced, so I spoke about that as well, 52 weeks in the year. But also, Marvel Comics has double 153 in Kabbalah. Incredible. Anyway, let's quickly look at next Saturday then, May 12th, 132nd day of the year. May 12th. That date's all about the Iran deal. Deadline date. May 12th. Notice that from next Saturday, there are 233 days remaining in the year. 233. I speak about that so often these days. Um, 13th Fibonacci. Also the 51st prime. 15 backwards. 5 plus 5 plus 5. It's coming back around to the 5 again. So 233 days left in the year from the Iran deal next Saturday, day before Mother's Day. I didn't realise till today that that date difference, no matter whenever you look at it, 233 days is always 33 weeks, two days. So the reverse, that is unbelievable. It's also in a future video that I've already recorded but not uploaded yet because it's too early. It's to do with all of that weekend coming up. 233 days is 33 weeks, two days. The reverse of itself. 13th Fibonacci, 51st Prime. 
Okay, so 132nd day of the year. It's the rerun deal, 12-5. 13 2, so <clears throat> double 13. Notice how 132 on a clock would be 92 minutes. Queen's age, 9 11, 9 plus 2. So it's 12 5, 132nd day of the year, 1 2 5. From that date, 233 days remaining. I've just showed how that's 233 days is 33 weeks, 2 days, all the time. <laughs> 233, 13th Fibonacci, master of time. 233 on a clock, notice how that's 153 minutes. 153. The fishes. So earlier on in the video, I spoke about 153 because it's a variation of Mother's Day date, the 13.5, 51 times 3. Mother's Day date itself is also 13.5, 5 times 31, the 155, where the video all started from as well. And this is just my theory on why I keep seeing a lot of the 153 at the moment. Master of Time, 233, 13th Fibonacci. On a clock, that's 153 minutes. 17th Triangular is 153. And we're in the 17th year since 9-11, aren't we? 2001. Next year will be the 18th year. Okay, so in yesterday's video, yeah, I showed how 12 and 13, the variants all get you those big numbers. It included yesterday's date for the 5-5. Five five. That's where it all cut and it came from. Um, Mother's Day connected there with the 133 on that one. Came to 133rd day of the year. 5-1-3 again. 31 times 5-1-5-5. Just a reminder of the 155s from the start of this video. <laughs> Sorry, because it is a good, all getting a bit confusing, isn't it? But they're all linked together. 155. Which we've got from number 5 in ordinal. Number 5 is alive, ordinal. 155 is the next new moon. Okay, yeah, sorry about that. So <laughs> we're back to... The recap of 12 and 13, creating all the numbers associated with time and also current times. Um, I missed out the obvious of 1 plus 2 plus 1 plus 3 for 7 days. Uh, subscriber kind of reminded me of that. I think it was lowercase. I think I can't remember the, to be honest. I think it was lowercase. Thank you. But I also needed to just show the rest of it for 12 times 12. It's the 144, which we know all about for time. 13 times 13, we know all about as well for pi, 169. 16th letter, 9th letter, I. Add those two together. 144 plus 169 is 313. Again, that's the 1 plus 312, which I showed here. The various links that that has, that massive number. It's obviously the 13 and 13, inwards and outwards of itself. The master of time number, 13. See how that works? Then just to finish it off, 12 times 13 is 156. 156 on a clock, it's 116 minutes. Flip that upside down, it's 911. 156. 156 prime is 911, as we know. So, yeah, huge significance with 12 and 13. Thanks so much for bearing with me. I hope this all kind of makes sense in the end. Um, it's all connecting together current dates, future dates. Um, the Iran deal, Saturday, Mother's Day, Sunday, Israel, Monday, New Moon, Tuesday. 
Cheers, everyone. Take care.